So the challenge was pretty badass last night, actually. Um, you know, I knew like what it was like from the show and everything, and I went in like really having no strategy. I didn't really prepare for it very well. Um, but uh, you know, I <laughs> like it was fun. You know, it took kind of a long time, but. You know, it was a blast, and you know, uh, I started out kind of near the middle, and my plan was to kind of just, like once I started, I came up with a plan to kind of just be in my own little area, so I dedicated like the bottom right corner to where like I was going to stay, because you know, eventually everybody was going to run into each other, and if I had my own little section, maybe I would last longer, and then Danny started going my way. And then, he, like, he tried <laughs> cutting me off. And, like, that's, like, the fun part is, like, there's a lot of strategy and that goes into it. And you got to really think about your move. And, you know, Danny cut me off. And then I decided, well, I cut Derek off kind of originally, which I kind of felt bad about. But when it comes to a challenge, man, for immunity, it's every man for himself. Um, so I cut Derek off and then you know he had to go the other way and then it was like me and Danny in the bottom corner and then eventually he decided to go up because I had like focused on the bottom and stuff and the funny part is I think Danny thought that he pulled one over on me for doing that but like that's where I was going anyway so he didn't really do anything he just kind of got in my way and took some of my squares but you know Oh well. So, you know, first person out was Derek, and then I want to say maybe Sunshine was next, and then it went Dina and Danny were out like at the same time. And so it came down to like me, Ricky, and Robbie, and like for a second I thought I was going to win, <laughs> you know? Like I was close. But then Ricky basically had the deciding move. Look, me and Robbie both basically had one spot left. And then Ricky could have went one way. And then, like, based on, because, like, I went before Robbie, like, since we got out in the same round, you know, I would lose. So, Ricky had the decision. He could either go, like, to the left, and then Robbie would win, or he could go to the right, cut Ro Robbie off, and then I would win. So, I was really hoping that he would go to the right and, like, cut Robbie off so I could have the win, but he didn't. He ended up going, you know, the other way, and I don't know if there was a lot of strategy behind that. You know, jokingly, I went to him, and I was like, hey, dude, if you would have went to, I think it was, like, G2, I would have won, but, you know, I'm going to choose not to really read into that too much. Um, it's still on the back of my mind, you know, because that just gives, you know, Robbie a little extra tub rig, even though he has more than everybody else already. Um, so that's just something to definitely keep in mind. And, yeah, I don't know. Um, so Robbie ended up winning immunity, which is fine. You know, he's in the six, it wasn't Danny, so that's cool by me. I just gotta try to get these confessionals in so I can save up these tug this tug rig so I can use it next round to outbid either Robbie or Ricky, whoever the target is at the time. So that's what I'll be doing.